Welcome to Swedish Hangover. <laughs> this is uh, D Carnegie. 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 <laughs> it's a D wedgie. <laughs> it's a Swedish brewery, one of the oldest in Sweden. It's a special porter. Um, and this is uh, the 175 anniversary beer. They have collaborated with uh, Brooklyn Brewery. And uh, that uh, guy from there called uh, Garrett Oliver. He's uh, really famous in uh, beer societies and so. They have made the porter beer as uh, usual in Sweden. And then they have uh, stored it in a bourbon, um, bourbon barrels. From, bourbon from, barrels. From, from Haven Hill. Yes. So this is a special anniversary. Trademark 1836 to 2011. This is a big span. Yeah. Anyhow, let's try to shoot the cameraman. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Watch out. Oh, but det är bra att taka för det här. <laughs> det blir man nockad. <laughs> ja, det gör man också. Asnice. Jag kan sälja dina You need help. <laughs> jag får upp den. Ha? Got it. Good for you. Yeah. It's a darker. darker. Yeah, it's... Look. Almost black at the night. Yeah, well, it's a pour, so it's almost supposed to. Yeah. Oh, I really like the foam. It's uh, very solid and uh, oh, have a nice. Can you do drawings in it? Uh, not really. I don't think so. But it's very solid uh, foam and has a really good whiteness to it. Mm. Mm. This one has a better smell. <laughs> yeah, you really can really feel the bourbon yeah. in this. Uh, it's a good one. Yeah. Tastes better uh, after, it, yeah. It's not like the bacon one. But no. It's, good, it's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> As a side note, the, the bacon beer we're talking about uh, is a London Porter from uh, Fuller's. It has uh, smoked bacon notes in it. It's a really it's good porter. A good beer. Yeah. Well, this one has a bit of nuttiness in it. What oh. to say? Yeah. <laughs> and the mouth feel, it's uh, almost, it not uh, it, as... It's, um, it's more on the, t on the front of the tongue than in the back. Yeah. Like, like the last beer. Yeah, and you don't feel the alcohol as much as in the last one. No, but this one is 8.8, so it's 1% less. Yeah, but it's. I think it's a huge difference from the last one. It is. What do you feel? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good one. <laughs> I like it. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty much taste. It's t it <laughs> <laughs> the deepest one today. It's yeah. pretty much a taste. No. Yeah. <laughs> it's almost nutmeg or something. Yeah. Yeah. Some hints of vanilla, but not that much. Well, um, really, it's a nice collaboration, and uh, I can't really comprehend the, what the, the cost on the Swedish sustainable market for this beer, but it's a good, still a good beer. Mm. What did you do? There's some hints of chocolate in it too. I would say. The after, after, uh, after yeah. burn, after taste. <laughs> the after taste, yeah. It's like the finish. Yeah, the finish is like chocolate. Yeah, some uh, hints of some dark chocolate. Yeah, yeah, so if you want on a date, you can serve this one, so you also get you get the beer and she will get your chocolate. Uh, <laughs> is this your date? No. <laughs> no, this is not my date. <laughs> Maybe another night, <laughs> but not tonight. <laughs> this is too public. <laughs> oh. Well, it's a it's nice looking bowl and... Um, yeah. But I'm, I'm, I'm not really... I'm not making friends with this whole <laughs> taste. Uh, it's a very different taste. Yeah. Yeah. It's so. It's, it's very stout-like in the color. Yeah. It's stout almost like the godless beer that we made. Uh, the review godless. Review one. Yeah, the godless. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it was almost the same. Very stout-like in the color, but not a, not in the taste of it. 
Yeah, but uh, this is the first time on those 175 years that they have uh, made something different with the recipe of this beer. So it has stayed the same for 174 years. So it was a good beer. This what it. We'll see you next time. Ta -da -ta -da. Ta -da -ta -da.